Hey guys, Captain CA here with Flats Class YouTube. Are you new to bone fishing? Are you in an area in Florida or Texas or the Carolinas or the upper Gulf Coast where bone fishing isn't really available to you, but you get to make a trip right here to the beautiful Florida Keys? Well, my wife and I are gonna show you today how easy it is to catch bonefish if you just use these techniques that we're about to reveal to you today. Come on, we're gonna go jump in the boat. We're gonna go make this happen. Flats Class YouTube is brought to you by Aquatraction, your go-to solution for advanced marine flooring. Let's talk about the tackle for this style of fishing. Uh, it's simple. This is a Shimano GLF. This is a medium light action seven foot rod. Good for accuracy, uh, very forgiving. You can throw these light weighted um, presentations to the fish. I've got it with a, made it up with a 3000 Shimano Ultegra. Uh, it's packed with eight pound Power Pro Super Slick V2 line. Now I've attached about 36 to 40 inches of 15 pound fluorocarbon leader. And then at the end of that, I've got a small boxing glove style jig. All right, this is an eighth ounce. Lots of times we'll use 1 16th. And basically the only thing you need to add to that is a shrimp. So this morning, because of simplicity and wanting to catch a bunch of bonefish, we stopped and picked up a few shrimp. And uh, what I like to do is pinch the tail off the shrimp, just like that, so there's some scent there. And we will rig, rig this so that I can slide it right in the tail, ride it up, come back through the shell, slide it up the bait. And that's basically it, just like that. Now, the technique itself, you won't want to throw right at the school of bonefish. You see the group of bonefish or the singles or doubles or trips that might be moving. What your goal is, is to throw a good 30 feet out in front of them. So you're gonna to wanna to make a smooth cast out in front of them, let the jig hit the water, let the bait go down. Because it's a boxing glass though, the shrimp is gonna stand, almost stand up. And you wait, do not drag it, do not move it. Try to bring no attention to it. Just the scent of the shrimp itself will get them to find it. And you'll feel a tap. You just come tight and reel as fast as you can. You're hooked up. It's that simple. That motion out in front of Blondie is a school of bonefish coming. They're headed right to us. Hopefully, it's going to give us a, a shot. They might come down our right side. They're drifting a little bit right. I like being up in this 12 inches of water. They're coming right down the right side of the boat. You can see them out there finning. The idea is to launch the bait well in front of them. They're moving kind of fast, so I'm gonna have to adjust. Definitely bonefish. See their tails come up every once in a while. See the little pushes. Flushing crabs and shrimp. It looks like they're turning away from us again. We'll get in position, try to hook one of these guys up. I'm 
Bondi with a bonefish on. Bondi with a bonefish on. Here he comes. Beautiful. Nice bone. Nice bone, girl. All right, I'm going to get down and help you. All right. Bring him back this way, girl. Get a quick pick. Reel down. All right, well, we got a few of them today here on the flat doing that simple, I mean, just super simple technique to catch bonefish. If you've never caught one, this is the absolute surest thing um, that you can do. So try that. A lightweight jig head, lightweight braid, small diameter fluorocarbon leader, and a small hook lay that shrimp out there to reiterate what we've been doing today lay it out there in front of that group let them find it let it be their idea if it's their idea you catch them every time if you like what you're seeing here on flats class youtube you like the tips you like the product reviews you like the adventure you like the shows the podcasts subscribe until next time captain ca signing off